Hello everyone and happy Friday. It has been great to have the campus reawaken as students return after the long break. And I've so enjoyed the conversations I've had with many of you as we've been crossing the campus. With the first week of classes now just about behind us, I wanted to drop you this video to say a few words about how the first few days have gone and to look ahead together to next week. I think you received an email this morning from Dean Foster outlining our protocols for exiting quarantine once you've received your second negative test result. It is truly wonderful news that we can soon end our arrival quarantine. I know just how much we are all looking forward to fuller opportunities to engage with one another. I also know that the quarantine has been difficult, but you all have done such a wonderful job responding to the circumstances and because of that, in keeping our community safe. Your efforts centered around our health and behavior guidelines were the key to getting the semester off to such a strong start. As I record this, we have nine positive student cases on campus and these students are safe in isolation and quarantine and receiving the care they need. We'll have additional round of testing coming in soon, so we'll seek to remain vigilant and see how things evolve, and we'll certainly adapt our strategies as we need to. So with that, let me again say thank you. It's been a good start, and that's because you all have taken the protocols seriously. In other news, I'm really pleased to share that we will have a new group of students joining our residential cohort next Saturday. We had some additional housing capacity, and so we reached out to the first years who hadn't yet had a chance to consider whether they wanted to study in residence this semester. So at this point, every Gettysburg College student has been given that chance for a residential semester this spring, something I'm really pleased to be able to report. These fellow students will soon enter the same arrival quarantine that you are now concluding. When they arrive, and when you have a chance, Reach out to them and offer your support and a hearty Gettysburg welcome. Lastly, I'd like to touch on this important moment before us. It's a big weekend and not only because of the Super Bowl, but because it's our first in-person weekend on campus. You all have worked so hard to put us in this promising position. Let's not let our guard down now. Too much is at stake with the new strains of virus being even more easily transferable than was true in the fall. We can't give COVID an inch or it will take a mile. If you've been in touch with friends at other colleges and universities, you know what I'm talking about. So many schools are seeing their early numbers spike and are being forced to engage in campus-wide quarantines or other more severe measures. None of us wants that to happen here. So, the decisions you make tonight, on Saturday, and on Sunday will have a direct impact on the entire community over the next week as we begin in-person classes. I know, I can count on you to rise to the occasion, to comply with the rules, and to keep one another safe. Again, I am so grateful for all you have done this week for Gettysburg College and for one another. Let's continue to focus on our goals and have a healthy and vibrant four months together in residence. So stay safe and take care. And let me end where I started. It is so wonderful to have so many of you back on campus. Bye now.